Yo, what's up guys, it's your boy Trip J back here today to talk to y'all about Black Friday, as you probably saw in the title of the video. Uh, before we hop into it and talk about this gameplay a little bit, um, it is another Nuketown gameplay, I'm sorry, I've been realizing I've been playing a lot of Nuketown, it's because it's really, most of what I play anymore is Nuketown, just because you get such good experience playing it and stuff like that. But, um, <clears throat> anyways, this is a uh, uplink, as you can see, I think the first half I go like 39 and 4 or something like that. But anyways, enough about the gameplay. Uh, like I said, here today to talk about Black Friday. Um, talk about some of my plans for it, like some of the sick deals I've seen around that you might want to check out, or uh, that a lot of people are probably gonna be freaking out over and stuff like that. Uh, every year, I didn't used to ever mess with Black Friday when I was younger. Uh, the first time I ever actually really went out for Black Friday was two years ago. So not the last one, but the one before that. And uh, I don't even remember what I got. I think. I think I got a game. I got like one game. And then last year I went out and I got like, uh, I think I got like two or three games and like one or two other small things that were like 20, 30 bucks off from what they normally were. But anyways, uh, some of the really sick deals I've seen that I feel like people are probably going to be freaking out about this year. Uh, Walmart, I saw they're selling a Samsung curved 55 inch 4K Ultra HD 60 Hertz LED smart TV. So like basically top of the line TV, the best you can get right now. They're selling it for uh, around a thousand dollars, which is a lot of money off. If you want to know the original price, the original price of it is nineteen hundred. So they're selling it for nine hundred off. So they're selling a TV for about a thousand dollars. It's literally the best TV you can get, and it's literally nine hundred dollars off. And then Best Buy is also selling a really nice sixty-inch 4K LED smart TV for eight hundred, which is seven hundred off from the normal fifteen hundred. So also another insane deal. Those, I feel like those are two of the main things that people are gonna be really freaking out for. Those are the ones people get trampled over to get to. <laughs> but uh, another thing I saw that was pretty cool that uh, some of y'all might want to look at. I have a couple friends that need new PCs. This is a, a desktop. It's a touchscreen all-in-one desktop. So like the all-in-one just means there's no like tower or anything. It's just the monitor and the computers attached to the back of the monitor. And it's also a touchscreen, and it's a pretty solid computer. But anyways, it's uh, selling for 450 compared to the original price of $1,200. So it's literally $750 off for a desktop. And 450 is super cheap for a pretty solid desktop. And like I said, it's an all-in-one, so it's pretty convenient and doesn't take up too much space, you know. But some of the things that I might actually be looking at and that y'all might be pretty interested in are uh, they're selling Black Ops 3 for the PS3 for $30 at Walmart. So you can literally get the uh, Black Ops 3 for half off if you want it for a PS3. So be sure to check that out if you have a PS3 and you haven't gotten Black Ops 3 yet. And um, one something I might be interested in personally is uh, if you buy Black Ops 3, Fallout 4, or Star Wars, for $60, you also get a bonus $20 PSN card with it. So you're spending the $60, which is how much those games normally would cost, and you're also getting a $20 PSN card with it. Now, I already have Fallout 4 and Black Ops 3, so if I did that, I would get Star Wars. I don't know. that might I might do that. I haven't decided yet. Um, for any of y'all that are fans of sports games, uh, I know Walmart's selling Madden 16 and NBA 2K16 for $27 each instead of, compared to 60 which is over half off, so that's pretty awesome. I might, I might uh, cop me one of those, maybe Madden or 2K, I'm not sure. I had 2K for uh, Xbox One, but I bought it on the marketplace, so I couldn't sell it or anything, so I just kind of lost it. But uh, if you're trying to get a new console, like I know a couple people that have been waiting to Black Friday to try to get a PS4 or something. If you're just trying to get a new console, I know Walmart, Best Buy, Amazon, and GameStop, and Target are all selling a PS4 with Uncharted the Nathan Drake collection for 300 instead of 350 which is the normal full price for it. And uh, I know you can also get a Xbox One with Gears of War Ultimate Edition, so the Gears of War game that just recently came out for 300 which is also regularly 350 so $50 off both of those. You can get that from Best Buy and GameStop. And I know GameStop's having a pretty crazy deal where they're selling the one terabyte Xbox with uh, Gears of War Ultimate Edition, Rare Replay, and Ori and the Blind Forest. I'm not really sure what Rare Replay or Ori and the Blind Forest are, but you get Gears of War again with it, and you get the one terabyte Xbox One, which is nice, because when I had my Xbox One, I ran out of hard drive space and had to delete games all the time. But anyways, you get that for 350 which is, that's regularly, regularly a $400 deal at least, because the one terabyte Xbox One, I'm pretty sure, sells for 400 by itself, plus you're getting those three games with it, so it's a pretty awesome deal. But, uh, yeah, so if y'all are planning on going anywhere for Black Friday, like maybe camping out in line or something, let me know. I mean, 
I don't. I haven't really decided yet if I'm actually gonna go anywhere and get anything. I might. I might not. I don't know. But uh, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment. I really appreciate you watching. As always, uh, be sure to share if you really enjoyed the video. But thanks for watching, guys, and peace out.